tonight. A 15 year old student now accused of attacking and severely injuring a teacher at Coleraine High School. That student is now under arrest and charged with felonious assault. And the teacher remains hospitalized and WLWT News 5's Karen Johnson has been in Coleraine Township all day working the story, getting information confirmed for us live right now with what she knows. Hi, Karen. Hey, Mike, I want to start with the teacher because I'm just now starting to hear from people who know her. They tell me she is adored in the district, very respected. I can tell you she is a 60 year old teacher at Coleraine High School and she did suffer a severe brain injury. Yesterday afternoon, Coleraine police were say a 15 year old student ingested an unknown drug and started acting distraught in a classroom at Coleraine High School. He is accused of hurting another 15 year old student by grabbing him and pinching his neck. Police say he began punching the teacher in the head. She was rushed to UC Medical Center and police say she will require extensive medical treatment. Afterwards, police say the student ran out of the classroom to the neighboring career center where he was located. Police say the student appeared to be suffering from a self-inflicted head injury and was experiencing hallucinations. Lincoln 80 can have another life squad respond for a uh, juvenile male student. They need to respond to the vocational building. Um, he's got a head injury as well. And after being treated at the hospital, uh, that 15 year old student was taken into police custody. He has been charged with felonious assault. A Northwest local schools would not make anyone available for an on-camera interview today, but in a joint statement with Coleraine Police, uh, they said the safety is a top priority of students. Uh, they tell me that uh, their counselors have been available today for students and staff. Reporting live tonight in Coleraine Township, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5. All right, Karen, we certainly hope that that teacher is going.